All right, El Joe's ready for camping. Give you a quick tour here. We added a couple of <clears throat> propane uh, tanks, just plumbed to one, but at a time, but basically gives us a spare. Um, this is a solar panel here. It, that just retracts back in. We got a panel up on the roof right now. That is me on the door, of course. Happy camper. Inside, we got a ladder up to the top bunk. Huge bed. That's my daughter's spot. She brings a lot of stuff. So, you know, she gets a big spot. Front table. Um, turns into a bed as well. So that's where mom or dad sleeps. And over here in the kitchen, we've got water and a little stove, gas stove, plumbed up to the propane, a couple of drawers for food, and cooking supplies, places to tuck your stuff in underneath the sink. Um, uh, van life uh, water hack. We've got dirty uh, or gray water going into the one tank, and when you get to, ta uh, to camp, you put your pump into the clean tank on the left, and once you uh, are empty of water, then you know your gray is full, and you got to go empty it and re redo it. So it works pretty well. Um, I've got the propane just right now, just kind of up on a little hook right there, uh, but it's basically splitting out to the heater. Well, my little Mr. Buddy. <clears throat> so the Mr. Buddy, we just just bring it out and turn it on. So, um, or tuck it away when you're not using it. Storage under there right now. It's mostly just electrical and extra parts and stuff. Um, things we might need. I've got a dual battery set up underneath this one, which I won't show you, but also a little charge controller here. <clears throat> Uh, let's see here, coming over here, opposite side of the fridge, got a little wardrobe closet, our backup charging battery, the Blue Eddy AC200, awesome, awesome little um, boondocking power, uh, power station, and right now just miscellaneous stuff, we'll put some jackets in here when we, when we get finished packing, food up top, up above the fridge, and the fridge is all half packed, good to go. We just put this fridge in, um, and uh, that's going to be a real nice benefit. And more storage down below for more food. So we're pretty much kitchen is all fully loaded, good to go. We just got a little beverage thing up here, which is kind of cool. We've got our tea, coffee, hot chocolate. So more storage up top above the vent. Um, and the back bed. The back bed is also pretty big. This is where my son gets to live because he has a lot of stuff. So the, basically our idea is the kids have a lot of stuff. They get a big bed. They, their stuff lives on their bed and that's their place where they're able to kind of do their thing and live. And then the rest of the living space we can deal with <laughs> uh, not stump stepping over all sorts of things. Um, so you can pull the, pull this up. There's a, it's just sitting on there. Um, there's a hinged board there. Um, you can pull it up to, to load, but I added this, this door here, this access door, um, because I wanted to be able to get at things after we got to camp. A lot of this stuff comes out like chairs, easy up, things like that. Um, but, uh, I wanted to be able to put our, my, my bag down here or some extra food, water, bedding, bedding during the day when we're not, when I'm not sleeping, stuff like that. So easy access became super important. Still need to paint obviously, but, um, <clears throat> anyway, we're about to head out. First family camping trip. Super stoked.